Ruby Queens, hi YouTube. Hope your day is going well. Like the title says, today's video is going to be a summer haul. I rounded up some of my favorite new in pieces, the good, good. So I'm super excited to share them with you. If you are new here, sis, my name is Chi Chi and I cover fashion, beauty, and lifestyle on this channel. If that's the kind of stuff you're into, you are in the right place. We would absolutely love to have you part of our family. Without further ado, let's get into this video. <laughs> Make sure you stay tuned all the way to the end, sis, because you don't want to miss any of the good gems that I found. All right, let's get into this video. So the first item I found is going to be this dress. I'm covering my face because I'm pretty sure it's going to wash me out. But it is this like textured, um, super lightweight dress that I picked up. I mean, for me, it was the sleeves, but also the little cutout detail in the back. Is it me or am I seeing a lot more cutouts in the plus size, you know, community? I feel like this is the first year that retailers in the plus size side of things have finally started to dabble into cutouts and things like that. And I am here for it. I love this cutout because it is not too deep. So you can wear it with a bra comfortably. And then it has a cute little string, which you can tie into a bow to kind of secure things in the back. So this style is a pull on style. You put it over your head. It doesn't have any zippers or anything for reference. Oh, let me just mention this for reference. I have all of my measurements in the details down below, but almost everything that you see here will either be a 16 and 18 extra, extra large. If anything is different, I will definitely let you know in the video. So I absolutely love the details on this dress. So it's like a very flowy dress with a pleating detail on the bottom, but I love the fact that they add a belt to really cinch in the waist. This is the perfect dress to wear to a wedding, to brunch with friends. You can dress it up with heels. You can dress it down with flats. You can wear this on vacation because it's super lightweight and it's also lined as well. And for me, the best part about it is how effortless it is. The color is gorgeous. I believe it also comes in black. However, like you don't have to worry about Spanx. You don't have to worry about any of that stuff. You get good circulation. It's light. It's flirty. It's airy. And in my opinion, it's a must have. It's a must have. Let me know your thoughts on this dress in the comments down below. All right, so you guys get the gist of the dress. So let's get into the styling portion. Chi Chi, take it away. So in this video, I'm not only just gonna be sharing clothing, but I'm also gonna be sharing accessories as well as makeup and skincare. Cause I don't know about you guys, but in the summertime, I definitely sort of like update my products because this combination to oily skin, <laughs> you know, we gotta get her summer ready. All right, so the next item I have for you guys here is going to be this um, two piece set. Just, I don't know, maybe it's because of the panoramic, but um, I'm all about effortless and easy dressing, which is why I love dresses and which is also why I love two piece sets because you can make multiple outfits out of them. The only thing you have to worry about is your accessories when you wear a two piece set. So I saw this two piece set and I was actually inspired to get this set by a girl I follow on Instagram. Her name is Marche Robinson. I believe that's how you say her name. And then I saw a similar set on Pockets and Bow here, Brittany on YouTube. So I was like, Okay, I'm gonna get this. And apparently this set is designer inspired. I cannot remember the name of the designer. It kind of looks like pajamas, let me be honest. Cause the first one I got, I was like, this is looking very pajama-y, but also looking very like brunchy as well. Very resort wear. So if you indeed get this um, set, I would say the trick to styling it is to elevate it with your accessories. So the bag you carry, a statement shoe, a statement bag, you know, a bow with a lip, like really zhuzh it up so it does not look like pajamas. But also if you're on vacation, this is the perfect piece to wear to dinner or lunch on the cruise, on the island, etc., etc. I just love it. Pair it with a cute tank, a white tank, preferably is how I would style it, and you are good to go. Let me know your thoughts on this one. Is she a keeper? Would you return her? Like, would you wear her? Or is she too much like pajamas for you? 
So the next item, if you follow me on Instagram, specifically on the Like to Know It app, you saw me share this two-piece set. It was too good, sis. Like, I just could not pass this up as soon as I saw it, especially from where I got it from. I'm like, folks are stepping up their game, okay? Folks are stepping up their game. I know seven years ago, you would never find something like this in Plus. So I'm super grateful to be alive right now, okay? To be here at the time such as this, all right? So here we go, it's gonna be a two piece. So I have the shorts for you guys up right here because I don't know where I put the blazer, but it is a two piece set. Now these sets are so sold separately. They do come in a cream color and they come in like a gingham color. And I believe at some point they came in the black color, but the black is completely sold out. And I'm fingers crossed, I'm hoping that this is still available when you see this. That's why it's super important to follow me on Instagram. And if you don't wanna follow me on Instagram, definitely follow me on the Like To Know It app because I always share my finds there first it, it does take some time to carve out time to sit down and film these haul videos and try everything on and do all of the you know the hoopla set up the lights all the things that you need to do in order to put out these videos on YouTube so if you really want to avoid things selling out definitely follow me on that app because I share all of my finds there all right so um i picked up this set in a size 2x in the bottom and 1x in the top and i would say that it fits pretty true to size i could have actually gotten a 1x in these shorts because they do have some room but i just prefer for my shorts to fit with room and that's why i always size up in shorts if you are a hippie girl if you got a butt that is the number one tip i can give you when your shorts loose and effortless doesn't draw attention to that area especially if you don't want it too. Quality wise, I would give this eight or nine out of 10. I like the fact that it's made out of a lightweight fabric. It does have real pockets in the front. The fact that it comes with a belt so you can help to really cinch and define your waist. All you need is a cute tank. I paired it with an orange tank and some orange pumps and you have a look, you are good to go. Okay, let me know in the comments below, how would you style this? Would you dress this up or would you dress this down? Or how else would you style this piece? So the next item I have for you guys is going to be this dress. When I say that so many of you told me on Instagram that you would never have given this dress any time of day, <laughs> I totally get it. But when I saw it, I saw the potential. It was giving me called Gaia, giving me Hanifa vibes, and I had to grab it. And honestly, this actual piece was sent to me from my friends at H&M, so I just want to give it you know put that disclaimer out there but i knew it was a piece and last i checked it's actually sold out because it's one of those underrated pieces that nobody checks for um when i shared it on instagram the girls went wild it's gonna be selling out soon so if you want it girl i would take advantage and grab this piece it was for me, it's the pleating detail that is so subtle, but so luxe, especially for the price we're going for here. Like you would find a dress in this chiffon with this pleating detail on places like Farfetch and Netta Porter for upwards of $500. It has a wrap detail around the bust and then it has a split. So that's how I kind of, you know, styled it up to make it a little sexy. I paired it with some really high pink shoes. I did a pink lip. I did a statement earring. So this is one of those pieces that you want to buy because you can keep it in your wardrobe for years and really style it however you want. It's kind of like a chameleon type of piece. Okay, if you have weddings coming up, I wouldn't necessarily wear this for a baby shower because black is kind of dark, but to each his own. If you have an anniversary or like a nice dinner or something vacation plan, I would definitely bring this with you. It's a lightweight, a very lightweight air chiffon. Now I will say in my opinion that it ran a little bit big. I had to take in the waist a little bit. So if you have my sort of like dimensions or my measurements and you're like smaller up top, bear that in mind. But overall, I think it's a great buy and I think I'm gonna have it in my closet for years. But I would love to know your thoughts on this. Is this a keeper? Is this not? Would you have purchased this, yes or no? And how would you style this? All right, so before we dive into the accessories, um, I thought we'd talk really quickly about some of the summer beauty updates that I have made. Um, the first thing that I swapped out 
in anticipation for summer is going to be this gel cream. I went from my regular moisturizer to this gel cream by Origins. This is the Ginseng Oil Free Energy Boosting Gel Moisturizer. Oh my God. This thing smells like a vacation. It just, as soon as you open the bottle, the, author the aromatherapy is just fresh, citrusy. Ooh, goodness. And then I love the fact that the, the moisturizer is very lightweight. If you have oily skin, gel moisturizers are your best bet. And I would say this is more of on the light to medium sort of like thickness. I do like how well it pairs with the next thing I wanna talk about, which is my sunscreen. Y'all, I am not a beauty blogger. <laughs> the unseen sunscreen, okay? So, the unseen sunscreen. You guys, if you follow me on Instagram, I talk a lot more about beauty on Instagram, and I've been raving about unseen sunscreen. If you are a dark-skinned chocolate girl and you always struggle with finding sunscreen, first of all, if you wear sunscreen, and if you don't wear sunscreen, says literally all of the money you're spending on anti-aging, anti-blemish, discoloration, hyperpigmentation goes down the trash if you are not wearing sunscreen because the sun is the biggest culprit when it comes to 99.9% .9 of the things, the issues that we have with our skin and sunscreen provides that barrier so that all of that money you're spending, okay, so I was using the play screen during this and during the winter time. I don't know if you can see that. Yes, you can. You can. I was using the play screen during the winter time, but I switched back to the unseen sunscreen just because it's a lighter weight formula. It is almost like a primer. So I mix it with my gel cream and I apply it all over my face. I don't know if you're really supposed to be mixing stuff, but I mix it. Okay. <laughs> I do. You get that good sunscreen coverage without having to deal with walking around here looking like an ashy cast you can also wear that without any makeup without looking ashy so definitely a must-have another recent update that I've done is I've switched to the luminous silk by I believe that's called yep by Giorgio Armani I was privileged enough to be invited to one of their master classes and the first thing I thought when I put this foundation on my face was skin now I do mix this with my NARS because you know it's just one of my favorite foundations but I love how skin like this is okay this is like has a cult following it's like celebrity endorsed all of those good things and I can see why I love 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 the finish of this foundation. So those are the mixes that I've been doing lately. All right, let's finally get into accessories. I'm super excited to share this next item with you because I got quite a few DMs about this and so many questions. So it's going to be, if you've caught any of our community posts, you've seen me in these shoes and it's going to be these shoes. Now, hopefully by the time this video is up, my sort of like spring, summer, or more like summer at this point, shoe guide is already live where I'm talking about all of the trends and you know, one of the biggest trends right now is the whole dad slash utility sandal you know you can go high end and rock yourself some chanel what i call i feel like those shoes literally give me the white chanel dad sandals literally give me like assisted living swag okay but it's what everybody's popping and rocking these days. So these utility style sandals, I like this one because it's affordable. It's under a hundred and it is actually, these are actually my first Doc Martens ever. I love that contrasting mustard, you know, situation happening. You guys know how we feel about yellow and mustard on this channel. Okay. I got my true size, size 11. And honestly, I feel like I could have gotten a 10 and a half just because this is quite like, if you have wide feet, you know, there's room in this because I got wide feet and I have room in this. If you're looking for a sandal that you can stomp around and frolic around, okay, this is it. I love the fact that it has a buckle so you're like, you know, this is a substantial, this is like something I would recommend to go to like somewhere like Coachella or like an outdoor festival because you do have some good cushion and some lift for my girls who are on the more petite side, but you also have some security in this style of shoe. It's also surprisingly lightweight. Like when I saw this, I thought it was gonna to be super heavy like the Doc Martens and it is not. It is very lightweight and comfortable 
on the foot. So I'm gonna link this and of course everything that I mentioned in this video. If there's something that I do not mention in this video, and I'm gonna say it because I've been saying it over and over and I always get the same question. If there's something I have on or I talk about in this video and somehow I did not link it for you guys, please click the link that says shop my outfits or shop my looks in the description box of this video. You will find all the details you need there. Now, if you check there and you don't find it, please feel free to slide into my DMs on IG and be like, sis, you did not include this link. And I will be sure to rectify that for you. The next, so we're switching from a, a flat to a heel and it's going to be these clear heels. Okay, that I picked up. These are wide width heels. Shout out to the wide width section at ASOS. Being a curvy girl with wide feet, like I just feel like sometimes the shoe options are very limited. And I love the fact that ASOS really makes their popular styles in regular and wide width. And it doesn't look like wide width, if you know what I mean. Like it's not super clunky or ugly. Literally, you need a pair of these type of, of mules because these are just like go-tos. You can pair this with all of the bright colors, the pinks, the orange, the yellow, the green. You don't have to think about matching your shoe to your outfit because this shoe will match every single shoe. I paired it with this orange fit right here, as you can see. And I didn't have to worry about looking for an orange pair of shoes because this matched everything. It's basically a nude. We'll link it for you down below. All right, continuing on with shoes is going to be these. For all of my girls who are going on vacation, you need these. I've been seeing these like platform style shoes come back in style in a major way. There's a Gucci pair that I've seen a lot of the influencers and the girls rock and I like this. I don't know if I'm 100% sold on this trend so I don't see myself spending hundreds of dollars on it. However, I feel like the fact that this is a gold and this is an espadrille style means that I can wear it for seasons to come on vacation because it's very much a vacation style. Also, I feel like the gold really helps to like elevate it and make it look more expensive, you know, make it look more dressy. So if you're on vacation, a cute little like swingy midi dress or like a maxi dress with a split so you can show it off, it would be perfect. You know, if you have a beach wedding or something like that where you do want to have some height but you don't necessarily want to feel that pain of being in a heel all day, I recommend this. The only um thing I want to mention is that if you are prone to blisters, this really got annoying to me after like a little bit of time. So I would put maybe like a band-aid on the back because it actually connects to this and then it wraps around your ankle. Um, I would put a band-aid like at the back of your heel so it doesn't bother you as much. But aside from that, this is also a wide width shoe. So for my girls with wide widths, getting where you fitting, okay? <laughs> I will link these as well. All right, let's take a break from the shoes. And then I picked up a pair of glasses. Um, I'm trying not to have the glare of the ring light in the shot, but I picked up these glasses. These are cheap and cheerful, y'all. You wouldn't believe how much I paid for these. I have my eyes on a said YouTuber's collection and it's close to $100. And this was like less than 20, almost 10. If you wanna try the little square frame trend and you don't want to commit and spend a lot of money, Check these out. I will be sure to link them down below. I also almost got like a brown pair. I love neutral accessories just because I can mix and match them a bunch of ways. So I will link those for you down below. So this is kind of like a quick overview of some of the things I've been loving. I would love to know which one was your favorite. What is your recent most favorite purchase for summer. Super excited to have places to go, people to see, reasons to get dressed, okay? <laughs> so if you wanna keep up with me when I'm not on YouTube, you can always find me on Instagram, sis, we share outfit ideas, we kiki over there, we talk about fashion, beauty, style, all of the stuff we do here, but almost on the daily, all right? And if you have a burning question, definitely slide in my DMs over there, I always respond. Definitely share this video with your girls, okay? Sharing is caring, especially if they're looking to revamp or looking for some cool and cute summer finds. Check out this video. 
end this video. So if you enjoyed this video, make sure to give me a thumbs up. Okay, and if you want more summer fashion, outfit ideas, styling tips, and hacks, all you have to do is subscribe now.